For a deficit squat, maybe you have the same height boxes available. If you do, great. Otherwise, stack up some plates in your bumper or other plates. If they're flatter, that's gonna be the best. But for the Better, Faster, Stronger program, I really just want you to get off the ground at least a few inches so you have more range of motion. That's really all the deficit squat is for to allow you to drop deeper into a squat. So whatever you have available, use that. Specifically for the BFS program, I want you to be up in a goblet squat for as heavy as you can, okay? So with a dumbbell, we're gonna squat down, pick this guy up, clean it up, we're locking it in, nice and strong into that deficit squat, nice and strong, back down. Now, if you get to a point where the dumbbell is super heavy and you can't seem to keep it up as a goblet, that's okay, you can let it hang this way and get down deeper into your squat. In the BFS program, I'm okay with that. If you know, you're know you up here in a goblet and you just can't seem to hold it but your legs aren't getting tired, then yes, drop it down and get as low as you can with that to load it up. With the kettlebell, same idea. We're here in the goblet, nice and strong, tight to my body dropping into that deficit squat. Again, same thing if you get to the point where you can't seem to hold it at the chest level in a goblet, but your legs aren't getting tired, then by all means drop it down and let that hang so you can drop into that really deep deficit squat. Now this isn't necessarily sumo for me. It's a hybrid of a narrow stance and a sumo stance. For the Better, Faster, Stronger program, I want you to do that. Not necessarily narrow, not necessarily sumo, a little bit in the middle. So maybe just slightly wider than shoulder width for you. Again, the Better, Faster, Stronger program is available on the Hard Work Works Fitness app.